Assalamu alaikum guys and welcome to another episode of Smart to Jannah. Smart to Jannah. <laughs> the far right's very own Tommy Robinson has been slung in prison for contempt of court. He's currently serving 66 days in prison. Let's face it, we've had rashes that take longer to clear up than that prison sentence. That being said, that didn't stop our very own drama queen and her subjects from beating the drums of fear to the public. It's inevitable, I will be murdered, I will be killed. In there is one of the most harshest conditions of a prison. You only have to do your research. Because I reckon I'll get killed in jail. Have him killed by prison gangs. It's one of the worst prisons in the country. If I genuinely believe if I go to jail I'll get killed. And I'm worried that Tommy Robinson may well be murdered in prison. Hand on heart, I believe I'll be killed in this prison sentence. To have me murdered in jail next week, I obviously, going go to prison is a matter between life and death for me because of our prisons are controlled by radical jihadi Muslims, yeah? Every prison. Every prison. Every prison. Every prison. I told you, not happy. In fact, they were more convinced than ever that this would spell the end of the Tommy. So, how did it go? And he does have the ability to buy some food from the canteen. He was wearing comfortable clothes of his own. He had grown a bit of a beard in the 12 days he's been in prison. A bit of a beard. Beard. And he told me quite bluntly that the staff were very good to him. He has a suite of cells to himself, including showers, exercise room, and things of that sort. He gets a daily medical exam. He has not been starved. He has not been poisoned. He has not been threatened. He has not been abused. Uh, he's got a TV. He's got a kettle. He's got all those, all those sort of things. The sheer manpower attending to time. There must be. 30 people working on He seems to be having the time of his life in there. What happened to every prison being controlled by Muslims? Every prison. Every prison. Every prison. I guess we're just gonna move past that yeah? Just like we seem to be moving past the return of the death penalty in the US. If you want me to come back and do more of these crazy 24 hour round trips, I'll do them. But I do need help to cover the cost of the flight and the train fare and the cab fare. The walking fare, the taking a dump fare, the you know sniffing cocaine fare. Yeah you heard me, <laughs> you don't believe me. Let's ask Lucy Brown here, she used to work very closely with Tommy. I know that there's a lot of cocaine going on behind the scenes that I just think that is thousands of pounds of um, potentially the money that you know people are giving you because they're living in areas which have been so affected by mass immigration that anyone talking about it they see as a hero and then you're just going to go and waste all of that up your nose. And that's exactly it, it's a justified cause, it's just being wrongfully exploited. Alright guys let's leave it there, Tommy we hope you enjoy your time in prison so you decide to stay there longer and until next time guys Bit of a beard, 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 beard. Salamu alaikum.